Seattle stand out. Sam Darnold finally Ooh. played, but they didn't actually play terrible. Honestly, they were one score away from uh, beating the Bills. Or Sam, tie, Darnold, tie the Bills. Sam Darnold imploded though. In the oh, second, yeah. he did not play great. Second but. half, he was three for twelve with like 10, 10 yards, I think. Still fire Adam Gase. Yeah. No, no, that was not good. He actually, but. Adam Gase didn't even call the plays anymore. Oh, really? He literally just stood and watched. But considering that they were playing the Bills, only one score game. But yeah, they're still the worst team. I think the story of that game is more about the Bills not being very good. I get that, but if you're not good, you have to give a little bit of credit to the other team. But yes, yeah. 31, we have the Jaguars. Yeah, first time being this low, I think. No yeah, surprise. Jag- Jaguars are not I mean, there. I think week one, maybe, they were this low. Last week I had them at 30, so they, they were uh, down one this week. They hung in there against the Chargers. After a 10-point loss, they dropped down one because the team that I had behind them is now way up higher. Yeah, okay, so now we are at 30. We have the Giants. Giants no surprise, right. but they were pretty close to being the Eagles. Actually, very close to being the Eagles, but they couldn't get it done. The story for them is over, obviously, with Daniel Jones. Yes. Balls. Yeah, yeah. But he, they still scored that drive, so I don't really... I mean, it's I'm not mad at that at all. It's, it's, like, it's, it's iconic. Funny. It's like, this is a funny moment. You have to give him credit for getting an idiot run in the first place, yeah. to be fair. And he got some wheels on him, apparently. He, he was the fastest player up to that, that point. What was he at? Like, he was like 21 20 miles per hour. He's actually he's like the third most rushing guys right now for QBs. Yeah, I mean, an 80 yard run will do it. Plus, okay, and at uh, 29, we have the team. Yeah, wow, the team team. at 29 yeah. beating the Cowboys. I had the team at 25 beating the Cowboys. I mean, yeah. I'm kind of well, confused. I'm kind of confused you? because. Well, five. I mean, I had them at 29. No, I had them at 30. Well, I'm just confused yeah, because. Well, yeah, the Cowboys, who are um, I two have and a, five I, with I a blowout loss to Washington. So I have, so I have the Cowboys at 31, <laughs> and Seth has the Cowboys at 29. And I'm just, okay, Levi, I just want to like hear so your where the rationale. Cow- wait, what because where are the Cowboys at? The football the team just beat them 20 to 3, and you have them. 25. Whatever! <laughs> and you have them um, ahead of the football team. What's your rationale behind that? Yeah. My rationale is when I look at the talent on the two teams, the Cowboys still have more talent. They just talent got destroyed! They just they got destroyed! Just they, got just, no they still have more. They still have a more talented team. Then how come when they play, they lose? Because that was just a bad game. If the more them, talented team loses to the other team, back. no, they will not bounce yeah, back. Who's the starting quarterback? Andy Dalton. Nope. Concussion. No, no. Out he'll be he'll be back next Sunday. Out this week. No, no. Isn't there back and forth like a tight end? Yeah, no, it's Ben DiNucci. Ben DiNucci. No, but they also have Ben DiNucci. They also, they, Woo-hoo! They also, they also have, uh, uh, what's his name? Garrett, Garrett, Garrett Gilbert. They also have him. So I think <laughs> where to go, Cowboys. Garrett I, Gilbert. Okay, we're we're done with this don't, guy. Don't I mean, you worry. We'll don't get you back worry. to the Cowboys. The Cowboys are yeah, still we, we, more talented than the Washington. So team. that doesn't make much sense. We have Falcons at twenty eight. Yeah, that's fair. Falcons are not good. They sh- they blew another one. Pretty typical. All yep. all Todd Gurley had to do was not score a touchdown. What do they do? They score a he touchdown. He tried to go down before it was too late. And he, Todd Gurley's actually one of the people known for doing yeah, that, and he, he has didn't like do it. Four of those in the last. Five, three or four years. So I'm just confused by what happened there. I mean, they literally, they had the game, but, you know. Maybe it was like, are we going to win this year? No. Should yeah, I just cut yeah. my stats? Sure. Know, typical Falcon fashion, you know. Uh, they let an onside kick dribble, and they could have just picked it up, and they let this happen. I don't know what's happening to the Falcons. I think they're just destined to lose this year. And then we have our Cowboys at 27. Yeah. Yeah, that would have been lower unless he put them at 20. So... You know what? The Cowboys are still pretty talented. You, Cowboys they, are a bottom they still team have, the They still have Ezekiel Elliott. They still have CeeDee Lamb. They still have Amari Cooper. CeeDee Lamb have, caught the ball zero times last week. They still have Michael Gallup. CeeDee Lamb got no catches last week. Yeah, because he was he didn't getting touch shut, the ball. Yeah, because they were shutting him down with the Washington defense. I think they should trade one of those. They players. shut down all of their receivers. Yeah, I understand that, but they so still So if the Washington have... defense can shut down their superstar talent, they're not superstar well, talent, the obviously. The Washington team has a pretty good defense. No, they don't. Yes, they do. I'm going to be honest. I didn't watch the game. I watched a little bit of the red zone. Um, but from what I've heard from other people's reactions is that Andy Dalton had like 0.5 seconds to throw the ball. That offensive line seems kind the of abysmal. Washington abysmal. team has literally held all their opponents under 30 except for one team. Which under is the 30? Ravens, which is the Ravens. Yeah, not under 5. Under yeah, no, I, average, I get buddy. that, but the Cowboys without their quarterback, of course, they're only going to score three. But according to you, Andy Dalton's a good best backup in the league. Well, when, like he, when, he gets, when he gets back, he might be still. When I honestly back, think it's... Lead the Cowboys to 4-12 I mean, and, and last in the division. It's Go. not Andy Dalton. I mean, it is Andy Dalton, but it's also not Andy Dalton. I don't know. I think they were kind of bad with Dak. Anyways. I think he started Ben DiNucci, Honestly, they almost lost. They almost lost to the Falcons with Dak. So, 
I don't know how good they were at yeah. that, but I feel like they were eight and they, eight, nine they, and seven. They were definitely at, better. They were a nine and seven at best team with Dak. Yeah, and at Dalton, best. They're now up. they're like a six and ten yeah, team at best. At best. Yeah. With, and they still have a chance to win the division. So uh, I think I think Eagles have this one. You think? Yeah. Well, once they have a chance. Yeah. I twenty six. We have the Vikings. Vikings at twenty six. All right. Yep. That's yep. fair. Didn't play. Yeah. Didn't play. Like you can't really say much about a bye week. Okay. Uh, twenty five. We have the Bengals. Yeah, they almost beat the Browns. I mean, Burrow looked great, amazing. Yeah. It, yeah, rookie receiver T. Higgins had another 100 plus yard game. Well, this is kind of typical, though. Downs. I mean, it's not really, it's not his fault, but I, it seems like he's always ahead with like two minutes left, and then his defense gives up a game winning drive. I mean, that's he's only done that once. No, no, no. He's, he has not. The Colts, they had already taken the lead before the last two minutes. Okay, well, it looks like he's, he's kind of yeah. blowing leads, though. He's, yeah, well, he's, he's blown two leads. Well, he no, scored a two. I'm pretty sure he hasn't, but. Listen, he, he, what other lead does he blow? How did he blow this lead, Drew? Yeah, he didn't No, really he blow didn't it. blow the lead. I'm just saying the Bengals, the Bengals as, a, as a whole. Joe Burrow had a game of his life this week. They, they, when I talk about the Bengals, I don't just talk about Joe oh, okay. Burrow. You said he blew. Sorry, he's I meant just the Bengals in general. Yeah, no, like they've come blowing. close. They, because they've Burrow, come close a couple of Burrow weeks, but I don't is think down by four. He, does a, he throws a touchdown pass to Gio Bernard. Oh, yeah, that's not his fault. He scored. A minute I mean, and six seconds left. The defense does no, nothing. No, Baker no, drops on the field. It's throws an insanely good ball to DPJ, the new OBJ, for a touchdown. All right. And also, quickly checking. Yeah, the Ravens game, they got destroyed. Bengals game, they won. It was the tie. Okay, the Chargers game, I think. The Chargers came back, but, okay, I don't know. No, the Chargers had the lead the whole time, didn't they? Uh, Texans at 20, what are we on? 25. 24. 24, yeah. Okay, Texans at 24. 24, yeah. yeah Texans are. They only have one win. Yeah. I mean, it's sad that they only have one win. Look at some of their close games, but they got kind of blown out by the Packers, not by 15. They were close to the Titans last week. I saw something from them I haven't seen all year, and they did not show that this week. So, sucks. Sucks for the Texans. I mean, I've seen them play like they did in the Titans other games. They just couldn't pull them out. But, yeah, but the Titans are a good team. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Them to OT. Agree. So, 23, we have the Chargers ahead of the Texans with Justin yeah. Herbert uh, Justin getting Herbert is, his, is first, a franchise quarterback. his first win. I love how, like, I mean, Justin Herbert is a really good quarterback, but he's won one game, and everyone's, like, really hyped on Justin Herbert. Yeah. Justin Herbert is a franchise quarterback. I'm not, I'm not ready to well, say that the, yet. But. He's the Chargers' future. I think he's the Chargers' near future. I don't know how far he'll go. No, I think he's their future. For sure. He's going to be like another Philip Rivers type guy. Stay there for a very long time. All right, I think he's going to be better I guess than we'll, Pro Bowl I guess, I guess we'll have to just continue rooting for the Chargers to make the playoffs with a wild card and lose. Yeah. All right. Makes a little difference. All right. Let's do it. 22? 22. Who do we got? The Panthers. I think they might be the highest they'll have uh, yeah. ever. Yeah. Three and four. I think they might be lower, actually, after the loss. I think they were like. 22 well, for the Panthers. I think I had about 17 yeah. last week. I had them. I dropped them by two. I think. I no. I dropped them by one. They went 22. down. 22. I mean, there's. Yeah, they were at 19 for me this week. They're three and four. With a near win over the Saints. Think about if they won that game. Four and, and three. And a near some, win some, over the I mean, who's in? Think about if they won that game though. Who's then in column one? Then the Saints and Panthers are. Call it, that's me. So Levi has them at like 26. Oh, yeah, I have them 26. I have 19. 19. I have How do you have them I have them at 20. You have uh, them at 19. Them, yeah. but that imagine 20? if they beat the Saints. Then it's four, and they're both yeah. four and three, no, and they're second in that division. Yeah. And everyone's like, wow, the Panthers are legit. Yeah. How do you guys feel about Teddy? Teddy had a bounce back game, but Christian Rick, McCaffrey did not play. He's no, he's back this week, though. With McCaffrey, if he's healthy and good to go, they're, they're Teddy scary. Teddy Bridgewater is in the last four, three, or the last five is three and two. I don't know. I still think that Teddy Bridgewater is a bridge quarterback. I think <laughs> this year he's starting, and, uh, and so he, next year he's probably starting, and 2022 he's probably mentoring an, a, a new guy. All right, well, that's fair. 21, we have the Broncos. Now, Broncos. Broncos. Personally, I think the Panthers are better than the Broncos. Yeah, definitely agree. Me. Definitely agree. You drew, yeah, you drew our agree. average way down for that one. I did not bring them down. No, Levi did. <laughs> the, I drew the Panthers down. Yeah, well, I brought the Cowboys up. You guys were the ones that drew the, the Cowboys no, you down. Drew yeah, the we agree with that, though. You, you, drew, the the Broncos Broncos up. Up. Yeah, yeah, you the, drew the Broncos up. Yeah, you drew the Broncos up. You drew the Broncos at 18, ahead of the Patriots, oh, yeah. the Cowboys. Well, the Broncos beat the Patriots, and I do think they would beat the Cowboys. I thought you don't think like that, though. Washington, you're like, <laughs> no, but that, no, they beat them. I don't care. I don't care that they beat them. <laughs> Who's the more talented? That's I don't that's care. That's Who's the more talented? Who's the more talented roster? I think the Broncos. Who are you taking? Drew Locke or Cam Newton right now? Who are you taking? Who are you taking? Who are you taking? Bill Belichick? 
taking. Let me just go to well, the old cam. Or Vic Joseph, whoever his name is. Vic, Vic Joseph. No, but I'm taking Vic the rest. Fangio. I'm taking the Broncos because they have more weapons. Courtland Will you Sutton. take the Broncos or Cortland Dolphins? Cortland Sutton's about to get back. Would you take Julio? Would you take Julian Edelman over Cortland Sutton? No, I would not. No? Oh, Julian wow. Edelman can't get open to save his life right now. I mean, you look at the Patriots. Okay, they have no open receivers. Which the Broncos? Which defense are you taking? The Broncos. Oh, 100 percent the Broncos. You say, the Broncos wouldn't give up 33 points to the 49ers. Yes, they would. No, they would not. Yeah, the Patriots were the number one defense coming this year, and they I mean, still the had Broncos, a good The Broncos year. held Patrick Mahomes to his worst game of the year, if not for the Chiefs And they still scored a, 42 points. Yeah, that's because of special teams. A but imagine they didn't get that special team. And a pick six. If they didn't get, the spe- pick six. If they didn't get either of those, Mahomes still would have scored in those drives. Would he really have? Yes, he, he would have. He would have got field goals, maybe. No, he wouldn't have. Really? Also, him driving on the field and handing off to Edward Tillett for touchdowns is just as good as him throwing touchdowns. So... I'm just saying, I think the, the Broncos, their defense is Worst game of the year, the sure. Like, he still had a fine game, we yeah. it. And you can't use excuses for other types of touchdowns as okay, his fault. Okay, at 20, we have the I'm not the saying it's Lions. his fault. I'm saying, if not for those, you the can't score would have been a lot No, it wouldn't have, because he would have scored on those. You, you don't know that. I do know you, that. No, He's passing Mahomes, and it's a Broncos well, defense. the Broncos held him to, like, three field goals in a row at one point, so I would say... And they still got 42 points. Stop yelling at me, you Broncos hater. All right, let's go. Let's move on. At 20, we have the Lions. 42 points to the Chiefs. There's no way the Lions would beat the you guys remember my prediction? What did I say? There's the no way. What was my prediction though? What was my prediction? Was it 40? Was it 40 to 10? Yeah. My prediction? Yeah. And what was the score? 42 18. 16. Or yeah. Something. I was on point yeah. that prediction. Oh. Woo! All right. Number 20, the Lions. There's no way the Lions would beat the Lions. The Lions the Broncos. would beat the Broncos. No, 100%. Not. The Broncos I don't know. That's would close. Kill the Lions. That's close. Beat the Broncos. I had the Broncos ahead of the Lions by one spot. So I do agree with Levi in this one. I had the Lions five better than the Broncos. Yeah. So what's happening? Seth just hates the Broncos because he's Seth. Who's bringing? Okay, I think you might be off here, Levi. Yeah, I had no. the Lions. At... I had the Lions at eighteen. And the Broncos well, at twenty-three. We all think the Broncos are better than the Lions. No, no I don't. don't. I have oh, the Lions five does. ahead of okay. the Broncos. Yeah, that's... Seth thinks the Lions are much. I better. disagree with that.